Century sardines in olive oil, fried. Not sure what to expect out of fried, but that's what it says on the back of the label. Also, ingredients, fried sardines, hmm. Olive oil, yeah, water, carrots, pickled cucumbers, chili peppers, and monosodium glutamate to enhance the flavor? These are sardines. How can you enhance the flavor of sardines? These are a product of the Philippines. So I'm not sure what variety of sardines they are. They might be a bit fishy. Go figure. All right, this is a different can. This is not your typical flat can with a pull-off top. This is a round cylindrical can with a pull-off top. Bonus. Now I'm gonna show you something that I haven't shown before. It's a pretty good trick that you wanna use with sardines and oil. Basically, it's draining the oil out of the can and then just eating the sardines. It's a lot less fat involved. So here we go, popping the top. Oh, made a little snap sound, that's good. But you don't go any further than that. You just leave that little opening right there. Now I get a throwaway pop can, pop bottle, cut it in half, and then drain the oil in there. You just let it drain out, and I'd let it set for a half hour or more. That way more of the oil gets off from it. You still got plenty of it to make it taste good. Okay, now let's assume that this is set for about a half hour and everything's drained out. Now we gotta get the rest of the top off. That could be a little tricky. I'm struggling. Whew, that is one tough top. That's like a bay leaf. Looks like pickles. and a clove, and carrots. There's a lot of bonus stuff in here. And there's some other random seeds and other vegetation to give it enhanced flavor. But as you can see, it's gonna be difficult to pull those out of the can. So I guess I'm just gonna dump them all out on the plate. Bottoms up. This could be disastrous.
That was a lot of work. All right. So far, appearance. They look a little fishier than I like. They do have skin. Not detecting any scales, so that's good. But I can see how they have been fried. Perhaps even deep fried, I'm not sure. There's a signature smell that comes off in fried sardines that is, to me, a little unpleasant. But it's not overpowering. And you can see they're a little bit more brittle than a typical canned sardine. That don't look too bad though. Complete with skeleton. I really don't like that smell, but it's not terrible. All right, here we go. Good. I am pleasantly surprised. I did not expect that at all. Still not as good as I think the typical canning method does with the square cans. Just heated up in olive oil and sealed. I still think those are the best. This is a different flavor. It's pretty good flavor. Just it takes away some of the natural flavor of sardines. If you want, you can easily remove the bones. Wow. I got to say it's pretty good. I would not rate it as high as beef jerky, but it's way better than broccoli. Century sardines and olive oil. It's a lot more work than I've ever had to do to eat sardines, but I have to say, definitely worth the effort.